Welcome to CirclePad, the easy website builder. Today we're going to take a look at mouse overs in CirclePad. So let's switch over to uh, CirclePad here. And the most basic mouse over you can ever make is you have some text, and when your mouse goes over it, it underlines. So I'll select, first to do it, I'll select the text. I'll go over here to Tools, Animation. Click on Animation, and click Mouse Over Create. And this gives you your text twice. This is what it looks like with no mouse over. And this is what it looks like with a mouse over on it. I just select the mouse over one and I click over here. I'm going to click edit text, underline, and then just hit exit and then bang. We've got an underline when we mouse over. It's very easy to make mouse overs. So I can go over to here and click animation, mouse over, edit, and then we can go make more changes. So I want to make the color change. I want it to be red and I want the text to be bold then there we go very simple very easy to make mouse overs so if we do want to do more complicated stuff let's make a button so I pull in a rounded rectangle shape and uh, I'll change the radius down and uh, let's make the height less and make the width less okay so let's say this is our button and then uh, I'll make a I'll make a uh, some new text here and I'll just call, I'll just leave it, I'll say new text. But I'll change the color to white. Okay, so if we select this, then I'd make a mouse over. I just click um, animation, create mouse over. And then here's two versions of our button. And I can take one of them and change the color so it's lighter. And then I can click edit object and add something like a drop shadow. And then there we go our button mouse over is done. And if we want similar buttons, I can just go under edit objects and hit copy and then paste and create a couple versions of it and then, then they all have mouse overs and I want to change the text on one of them. I can just hit animation, edit mouse over, and then I can change the text here to say, let's say it's going to open something like open and change the text the same here so it says open now I want to move them together so it doesn't move when I hit the mouse over so I can use like the arrow key or make sure you select both objects using shift so that when you mouse over the text looks the same okay so let's try uh, let's try something uh, let's try something new just some simple stuff if you bring in a photo here uh, let's bring in a photo of a monkey or something like that you can do like little changes so that when uh, I can create a mouse over on this and say let's do things like uh, oh I don't know uh, some brightness and contrast and so the image looks a little bit different when you mouse over it and there you go and you can even do more stuff in there like you can create little shapes uh, I can create like a circle or a menus or all kinds of fun like little graphics things that you can do that change as you mouse over. Uh, another example of that just to show you what you can do is like here's uh, here's my mother's dog and uh, when you mouse over it's got a haircut and then when you mouse over the nose it made an invisible shape there and it says awesome. So you can do all these fun uh, graphic things. Uh, you can also build uh, little menus and things like that so if we do some new text here I can do some text that says menu and I can create a mouse over where you say um, you create a mouse over and then you say new shape uh, bring in a square make it a little smaller and th and then make it gray color make a gray square and then when I exit when you go over the menu this me the menu starts to appear and then if I edit that mouse over I can add some new text in there and yeah, bring this text down to here and then say okay this is my link this will be some link or another and then I can make that link another mouse over so you can put a mouse over in a mouse over so if I click on animation I can create a new mouse over and this one turns blue when you mouse over it so you see it turn blue and then when we exit it we go over menu we can go to our link so that gives you a little overview of mouse overs and uh, I hope uh, I hope if you like to see more about CirclePad, you'll visit us at www.circlepad.com. Thank you.